Adam Lennon. It's Maddie Gibson is going to take this with her left foot. Goes short to Kelly Shine. Shine back out to Gibson. Gibson comes in on her left foot, gets a bit of space, gets the strike off, and that's oh, in the top corner. What, what a, a start! Goal. What a start by Atlone Town here in this evoked.ie Women's Cup semi final. Set her off perp- perfect, perfectly, and Adam, just watch this replay here. Ah, it's a brilliant, you know, something they've obviously worked on during the week. You know, what? A, it's a great start for Atlone, you know. Because you could struggle then to get out and fatigue sets in, and, you know, a simple mistake, but then again, Maddie Gibson's. Putting huge pressure, pressure on Sinnott there, and that ball should run into the box to Williams, but she has to come Ooh. out. She's under huge pressure. Maddie Gibson has it. There's a chance here. She pulls the ball back, and that's going to be 2-0 oh for Atlone. It it's a huge mistake by Wexford. But again, we've been talking about the pressure that Atlone have been putting Wexford under, and there's a huge, huge chance that Maddie Gibson made all at herself, Adam. It's a poor ball back. I think it's Sinnott. You know, we've just been saying how good she's been, and she you knows she puts her keeper into a bit of trouble but Gibson does not give up on it and it's a brilliant finish from the edge of the box uh, and that was vital because that's as good a delivery Adam as you're going to see at any level in this country uh, absolutely you know it's fired in there that's one thing you want from your set piece taker is to f- whip the ball in lots of pace so that all you need is a glance or anything to take towards goal but it's a great defensive header Myrna Devani trying to just win possession and play and she's won it again Maddie Gibson she has a couple of extra defenders in front of her she got Corbett outside her can she slip it She's oh, gone she's herself. Gone. Hits it with the left foot and that's in. Oh. It's 3 0. What a hat trick. It's 3 0. Oh. At Lone Town 3. Wexford 0. That's an unbelievable goal on the counter. Straight from the Wexford corner. We're talking about the quality of uh, you know, Rossiter's uh, corner that she took. But look at after a finish. Riley Gibson. That's as good. It's difficult to see it on a monitor as well. But that's Adam, a what a goal. Finish. What a finish. They mightn't have had loads of creative play being on about, but their work rate is phenomenal. You know, it really is phenomenal. As Darty comes forward here, again her pass, there you go, it's uh, Scarlett Heron just cuts out that forward pass and Gillian Keenan now putting Watkins again, Watkins who's three goals this season in the league, plays a decent ball out to Della Doherty, Doherty gets it across the box and there's a big chance Ooh. here, here's a chance for Wexford and oh, it hits the crossbar. crossbar, again I think it's Murphy with the strike and it's gone it's out for a corner, corner. That's uh, you don't get much closer without no. scoring. And we'll hopefully just get a replay of this one because uh, Becky Watkins again, she's been a huge threat, plays a ball outside to Doherty, the centre half who stepped forward, Ball played right across the box. Great ball. It relieves pressure again, you know. Now they're up the other end of the pitch. Ball from Shine straight into Maddie Gibson. Ga- Gibson is a one on one with Sinnott. She looks to go on her left foot. There's a great chance here. And the ball is oh, gone. It's just save. it's saved by Williams. Does really well. Tries to clear the ball, but it's with Murphy. You know, Sinnott can't afford yeah. to tackle yeah. Gibson there because she's on a yellow card. Yeah. So, Athlone have been so solid back today from. All the centre half, yeah. really, you know. Clancy with the cross, that's going to be decent. It's it's in a dangerous area. Ball drops down, but again, Mern Devani and oh, Brennan Kelly Brennan. If she can get a touch here, she's away. She, oh, is. she is. She's just knocked the ball past Conlon, and she's gone one v one. Huge opportunity here. She just her next touch just didn't work, oh. but she's gone inside and brilliant defended by Conlon. And, it's and over. that's it. At Loner in the 2022 evoked at IE FAI Cup final. You could just see over on the bench what that means. You know, huge support here today for Atlone in this semi-final but this is phenomenal it's history for Tommy Hewitt and the Atlone Town ladies it's a massive massive thing Maddie Gibson with the hat-trick but an all-around super performance from Atlone they really really didn't give Wexford much of a chance today